All right, now that you've added your video to your Leadbubble widget, the next step is to head to the next tab here in the setup process, which is the channels tab. And a channel is a way that you can get somebody who's viewing your Leadbubble widget to interact with you, to take a specific action. So whether that is to email you, call you, uh, send you a text message, look at a, a specific piece of content or video, um, we have many different ways for somebody to interact with your lead bubble widget and take a specific action. So once you're on the channels tab, you'll simply click on the plus sign here, and this will bring up a list of available channels that you can add to your lead bubble widget. As an example, we'll choose email. And on each one of these setup pages for the channels, you're gonna notice a help video up here too. So if you're stuck or don't understand how to get things set up here, you can always click on the little help video and that'll bring up a video that will explain step by step how to set up the specific channel that you're in. But overall, you come in, you can choose an icon for your channel, right? Select a specific icon. You can give your channel a name, email me. Um, you can select integrations and we'll go over this in another video, but I just wanna show you what this looks like once you add a channel. So once you have added your channel, you'll see this button here added to your lead bubble widget. And when you click on it, it performs a specific action. This one happens to be email me, okay? So again, if you need help with a specific channel, you can always click on the help video right up here and we'll lead you right through setting up that specific channel.